What are you, what are you doing? What do you think this is here? The Lord don't use your money! This summer. I mean, I like pencil shavings. Get ready for an adventure that will blow your mind. Dinner! Dinner! We are all dinner! You know, I promise I'm gonna pay you back. Amarilla? Amarilla? I'm always prepared. Ah, que bueno! Que bueno! At every point in a human being's life, everybody needs change. That's what Sean Miller lacked. This is his story. I wanted to live deep and suck out all the marrow of life. I lived so sturdily and Spartan-like as to put root all that was not life, to cut a broad swath and shave close, to drive life into a corner and to reduce it to its lowest terms. Nobody wants to be original anymore. Nobody wants to like have their own voice. Everybody just goes with the mainstream. They don't. They don't want to branch out at all. Uh, the millions are awake enough for physical labor, but only one in a million is awake enough for effective intellectual exertion, and only one in a hundred million to a poetic or divine life. To be awake is truly to be alive. Would you like to come and sit with us? Alright, good luck on your run! I've never yet met a man who was quite awake. How could I have looked at him in the Sean! face? Sean! Sean Miller! Sean. Is that you in here? Sean. Sean? Sean. What are you doing? I'm sleeping. What are you doing? No, no, Sean, what are you doing? I'm trying to suck the narrow from the land. What are you doing? This land, this is, the, the, this is where you want to be right now, right here. I'm in nature. Do you realize really where you are, Sean? Do you realize you're wearing a tie? There's a pond right there, you see that? I get my food from that pond. You see what's behind it? No. Highway? Trees. 18 wheelers? Okay. Do you see this all around you? There's grass. You hear that? They're birds. I hear a bird. I hear dinner. I see 18 wheelers. There's the hospital. Well, come, come back, Charlie. I mean, you get a minivan because you get a kid, and then you 
get a bigger minivan because you get another kid and the next thing you know like you have four minivans lost. you need a bigger house to put the kids in a bigger garage to put the minivan in and then the next thing you know it's club soccer right you know right. it's 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 sam's club and you just can't get out of it and that's where i am it's jumbo packages of toilet paper Rebelling against society as a whole, like running away from society probably isn't a good thing. But rebelling against ridiculous rules could be useful, I guess. It's probably like mentally unstable. I don't know. Uh, honestly, I, I think he sort of feels uncomfortable around normal people and it's kind of weird. I came back because I didn't need the woods. I didn't need the pond. All the while, the pond was right in here. And there are thousands willing to hack at the branches of evil, but only one for every one of those thousands is willing to strike deep at the root. And so now I'm back here, still getting demerits, still eating Bosco sticks and still living in the wild. And so, Sean Miller realized where he went, his pond went with him. Burritos in my bike tires? <laughs> Kevin Moore, but I'm the next best thing. <laughs> <laughs>